Okay, guys. Day is gone. Now, first of all, I want to start off with something. The setup of this game was a fucking pain in the ass. And I'll tell you why. If you have a uh, NVIDIA graphic card, what's going to happen is most probably your game is uh, going to give you an error. Even though you have the latest drivers and everything, it's going to say that something along the lines of that your driver, your video graphic adapter has been reset and exiting the game. It might just happen while the game is starting before the menu appears. It might just happen, um, let's say, while you're in game. Now, it doesn't matter, um, you know, what point version of the NVIDIA driver that you have, but if it's uh, anything that is like, let's say, 466.14 or something, you're going to get that error. Uh, the only way for me to fix it was I tried talking to NVIDIA, I tried, uh, tried talking to Epic Games, um, I tried talking to Sony. They don't know what the hell is going on, so I had to figure it out on my own. What I had to do was the, actually um, downgrade my graphic uh, drivers. Right now I'm using 446.14, and the game works just fine. Of course, the temperature and stuff is a bit more. but And I have been vocal about this as well before. NVIDIA has been messing up their new drivers, as always, the, how they do. However, for me, what I found is eight. Uh, sorry, 466. Uh, sorry, 446 or 442 are the best one. Second thing I want to tell you guys is, look at my mouse. If I go here, it says memory. So this is the memory of my video card that is being used right now. This 5501 is the megahertz. So this is the clock speed that my GPU is right now capped at. I've seen people who say, oh, your GPU is capped at 5501, people have it on, people uh, have their GPU going up to 7000 megahertz. your GPU is fucked, this and that, it's not that. You guys need to definitely learn how clock speed works, and you guys need to learn, of course, it's not for everyone, it's for people who basically engage uh, in a communication like this with me. So you need to learn how clock speed works, and you need to know um, why or how a manufacturer, MSI, or anyone caps the clock speed and you have to overclock the system to actually bring it up. I can basically overclock it and take it up to 14,000 if I want. You see this limit power? It's going to show up limit temperature as well. That means that it has been limited to a temperature to stay at that, or it has been limited to a power where it can only maximum go to a clock speed of maximum this megahertz. And uh, that is as per MSI. Again, I can overclock it, but I've been vocal about that. I don't. However, jumping in the game right now, um, you guys can see the game is working all fine. Oh, by the way, um, settings. Um, right here, we're at full screen, 1080p, 144 hertz. We're not resyncing. Of course, we're uncapped at frames. Graphic is very high, the highest that it can be on everything of course my system moves for HDR so there's that. No, Leon's been fancy shit. Now I have been um what is it called? Um I have been waiting for this game for quite some time now. I wanted to play this since it came out on PS4. Um I love survival games. I bought this game as soon as it came out. But um yeah I was just not able to play it at that time. This is my first time playing it, so I might not be that familiar with the controls and everything, so don't shit on me wait, for that. Wait, wait, here. Um, you guys good. can see our frames. Oh yeah, also, our frames are over 70, which is good at 1080p. And you guys can also see that um, it anyway. it's running at DirectX 11, not at DirectX 12. So that means the game does not have ray tracing. They basically just made the game for PC, but they did not upgrade the graphics, I would say. It's the same rendering, everything's the same. And it could be a bit buggy, which is normal as well. Um, oh shit. Okay, and you guys can also see the cutscenes are basically not as good as the gameplay itself. So that means even the cutscenes that they made, they're the same. They don't, uh, they did not do model the cutscenes. They just made it. Losing a lot of blood. 
It's not getting far. Come on. Search him. Bleeding out. Well, that's a hell of a way to go. It's slow. A lot of pain, but I suppose you know about that. She was right still breathing when we found her, you piece of shit. I wasn't gonna waste the bullet not on her. Hold on for a second, hold on for a second. Now, where's the stash, Leon? If you tell us, uh, unlike you, I can promise you we'll make it quick. Don't look like you'd be suffering for too long. Leon, you got a little problem here, see? They can smell your blood from all the way down there. is gonna find out. Fuck you. Goodbye, Leon. Yeah. No, wait. All right, all right. No, no, no. I got it right. Here, take it. Where? In the cemetery. It's in the old cemetery. Thank you. No, you said. Okay, do it. Let's get it over with. Don't leave me out here, man. Do it! You goddamn liar! Do it! <laughs> Tuck's gonna need something for the bounty. Okay, so I believe we just hunted a bounty. Right then, bro. Um, we don't want to leave anyone to the freaks. This is, of leave. course, just a. Um, it's not going to be a full review or an in-depth analysis of the uh, game and stuff. It's just going to be um, a quick video that I just want to put out as soon as I can. You know, and if you guys can subscribe, that would be awesome. Um, I'll search this camp, see if I can't find and, something to fix up this crash. Uh, yeah, I will definitely make an end of video once I'm a bit further down in the game, and I will definitely talk at that time. If you have any questions, drop them now. Of course, as always, I try my best to answer them as soon as I can, and uh, peace out, guys.